Hey with PCOS Life. It is Monday, even though it's supposed to be Sunday, and I'm really sorry about that. Um, I'm Samantha, and I've been moving into my new house, which is exciting. But on the other hand, I feel really, 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 really bad that my video wasn't in. Um, so I greatly apologize. I'm so sorry. We are talking about, I'm going to totally butcher it, <laughs> like everyone else, acantosis nigricans. Um, this is a symptom that I was kind of excited to get the topic about. Um, I have it like this much. So it's interesting that um, it's kind of like more of an unseen symptom normally for most people. Like just a lot of people don't have it, I find. Um, the only place I have it is around my neck. You can see. Just a little bit. It's not bad. I, for the most part, don't let it affect me. I didn't even know what it was until um, we got this topic, actually. So I was really, really excited to find out what it was. Um, about a month ago now, I started seeing like a dark ring around the back of my neck right here. And um, my mom, when I went home last week, was like, oh my gosh, we need to take you back to the endocrinologist. And she thought it had something to do with my thyroid. And she just keeps telling you my neck is growing and it looks really big. So um, I was glad to find out that it had a name and it was actually a symptom and that there's not something else wrong with me. <laughs> but um, I, because I've only had it for a month, I really didn't let it affect my self-esteem. The one time I got all dressed up and um, I wanted to look really nice, I just put some cover up on it. It was fine. It didn't really make a difference. I wear my hair up all the time, so I don't let it affect me all that much. Um, yeah, that's about it. If anybody else has it and wants to share, feel free. It was so nice to talk to you guys. I can't wait for next Sunday. Bye!